Hey, what's up, guitar dudes and dudettes? Thanks for checking out my video. I'm gonna share a little bit of my day with you. Every morning, it's like I get up in the morning and I get my cup of coffee and I come down here and I check my email and so on and so forth. And then I go on a hunt for a Gibson SG. I've been looking for a Gibson SG for I can't begin to tell you how long. So every day I get up and I check reverb for the latest, great, greatest uh, Gibson SG that's been uploaded. And I can't generally find one that suits my taste. I looked at some of the newer ones, uh, the San or the Sam Ash, the Chicago Music Exchange new ones are kind of cool, but um, I'm not really into those colors. And um, really was kind of looking for a white one, and was, but I didn't want gold hardware, and those are kind of hard to find. And if you do find one, they usually got some kind of problem with the finish already, like it's going yellow or it's got weird pink spots on it or something something going on with the nitro and the white they used I don't know so anyway my daily search continues and uh, I was really wanting a used guitar I didn't really want to spend a lot of money anyways trying to keep it on a budget this time uh, I had an SG before kind of had a hankering for another one but something different and unusual so lo and behold today this thing pops up this used Gibson 2017 SG Special T satin black electric guitar hmm never seen one of these before because of the zebra pickups it looks pretty cool and it also made me think 57s even though this is a 60s pit guard so I'm like wow I don't usually do satin but I kind of like that tuxedo look and uh, let's see what this is about so I slide down here and I read about this thing and other than it's a 2017 and there's the serial number no information whatsoever and I don't know if you've noticed but if you go to Gibson's website now you can't really uh, pull up their old model guitars they've totally blocked it which thank you Gibson that was a great resource you've taken away from us so anyway I went out in the world and I searched for Gibson 2017 SG Special T Satin Black Ebony and um, there aren't very many of them I ran across this one on eBay uh, and it has different pickups in it but it doesn't say what they are or covered looks like the same guitar but can't really tell much about it finally found uh, this one on eBay this one if you read the full description says it's got 40 90s in it 490R or 490Ts um, that's not really what I was hoping for but then again it doesn't have the zebra pickup so I'm like well what's going on here I don't think it's the same guitar finally I found this guitar that was previously sold about a year ago on reverb and it is the same guitar and this guy has a much better description and he says this has 57 classic zebras in it and I'm like bingo and his sold for 680 with the shipping in excellent condition but no bag hmm looks pretty cool so still curious as to where this guitar originated I finally found it on the UK version of Amazon and from what I discovered from reading the text and the comments on here this guitar was available only on UK Amazon as a limited edition in 2017 and it does have 57 classic pickups in it and it is not a color that you could get from Gibson in the USA it's basically like if they did a custom shop model for Sam Ash apparently they did one for Amazon UK and this is it so it's a somewhat uh, rare guitar uh, verified on here and at least in the question and answer section guys said they took the pickups out they do say 57's on them so same guitar and um, I was like wow now I'm really intrigued so differences in this guitar obviously it doesn't have binding because it's a special it's a satin finish uh, but pretty much everything it does not have uh, you know dip switches or any of that stuff just standard volumes and tone controls uh, supposedly it has a really nice thick slab of rosewood and I uh, kind of like the uh, smaller uh, fret indicators I think it looks kind of cool 
So I went ahead and threw the dude an offer. He was asking $7.99. I threw him out there $7.20. Boom, it didn't take him a minute. And I just bought a mint condition 2017 SG with what I believe to be 57 classics in it. And I'm pretty freaking happy about it. So I think that's a pretty good buy. And um, I think it's a guitar I'm, I'm really interested in because it, it doesn't look like every other single SG out there. Um, so I like it. And I can't wait to get it. And when it gets here, I'll let you all check it out. Rock on.